Okay, I thought I would give you an update on the installation of the solar panels. We're having 18 panels installed. Uh, each panel is rated at 340 watts. So, if wired in series, that would give us 6,120 watts of power. Uh, each panel is 30 volts, so wired series would give you 540 volts. Now the power is the watts, so that's 6,120 watts or 6.120 kilowatts of power. And volts are the force that it is pushed through the wire. Whereas amps is the amount of current. So this system, based on our past usage, should give us a little more than what we've been burning. So hopefully it will uh, make the house basically independent of the grid however we are connected to the grid so if our system doesn't supply enough power we'll still have the grid and there will be a by meter which allows what we don't use that we're generating to go back into the grid so that will give us a plus uh, amount on our bill so if at some future date if we're not generating enough we'll be able to use that power that has gone into the grid and not be charged extra for it now this system since it is connected to the grid we do not have a battery system so if the grid goes down our system will go down I'm planning to have a wiring system so that we can connect a generator in the future. I'm not going to buy the generator right away, but I'm going to have it wired so all we would need to do is plug it in when I bought it. And we're planning to get a generator that will be powered by propane so it will we'll connect right into our propane system. And if the grid went down then it would be automatically switched to the generator so we shouldn't lose power so that's where we are now we're getting the panels the frames that they will sit on installed and hopefully we will have all the panels installed shortly and I read that uh, the angle that the panels are sitting should be equal to the uh, uh, latitude and the, the panel should be pointed south to get the most solar uh, power so very interesting I don't know a lot about it but hopefully after we get everything installed and after we've had it working for a while we'll know where we are and how it's working I'll post more videos as I get more information thanks for watching